Throughout my childhood, I was, I was very healthy. Uh, I was athletic, I was involved in the community, uh, I was in Boy Scouts. And then when I was 13, um, things changed. I started having these tics and these repetitive movements, and I soon developed more severe symptoms. To put it in simpler terms, I had a strep throat infection that triggered uh, an unusual autoimmune response and caused encephalitis or brain inflammation that wreaked havoc on my body. I went from a healthy 12-year-old boy who was playing soccer and baseball and having fun with my friends to a disabled 13-year-old who had tics that were embarrassing, um, you know, hitting myself in the head at times and having to repeat basic maneuvers throughout my daily life was so frustrating and debilitating. Over the course of, of the next five years of my life, I probably tried 40 different drugs to help. The side effects of all these medications outweighed the benefits that I, that I may have seen, and it was just not a high quality of life for me at all. Instantly, uh, I noticed that it helped reduce my tics. It helped reduce my anxiety, dialed down all these symptoms, and helped me to just relax. Uh, it, it was amazing, instant relief. Uh, the problem was um, there's side effects associated with smoking marijuana as well, especially in my teenage years. Uh, this was, you know, 10 years ago when marijuana was still illegal in Virginia. I had never heard of CBD until up until this point. I was still using marijuana um, as, as medicinally as I could. Uh, I learned about CBD and found that um, this could be perhaps the, the anti-inflammatory medicine that I was chasing for so long. I remember the first time I ever tried CBD and I mean within minutes I felt the kind of anxiety melting away um, and, and giving me some relief so that I could take a step back, refocus, take a deep breath and just move on with my life. Uh, I moved back to Virginia and I looked around for CBD and there was nothing. This was back in 2016. Um, CBD was still considered hash in many states. And so I was at a loss. I needed a, a quality source of CBD that I could trust. We can't expect to to take uh, CBD or THC or any cannabis compound and just have it get rid of all our problems, right? That would be great. Um, but for me, it definitely was the catalyst and the tool I needed in order to get my health back on track. Really, identifying the benefits of CBD changed my life. Uh, and that's what makes me so passionate about it today. I owe a lot to this plant. 